evening sir my name is mohammad aftab shamim id 2019 a7ps0140 this is my matlab assignment the main focus of my assignment is uh, second order differential equations and differential equations in general so this is the acknowledgement this is the table of contents okay, so theory so basically matlab the abbreviation of matlab is matrix laboratory MATLAB allows manipulations, plotting of functions and data, implementation of algorithms, and creation of user interfaces. Basically, lab, la, MATLAB is a software that we use to find solutions of various mathematical problems. We can find solutions of equations, and it's very convenient and helpful. So, our main goal for this assignment is to solve differential equations. A differential equation is an equation that relates one or more functions and the derivatives. the derivatives represent the rates of change therefore differential equations play a prominent role in many dis disciplines including engineering physics economics and biology mainly the study of differential equations consists of study of their study of the solutions then what first order differential equations are is the highest rate of the differential in the equation will be once so that is the y will be differentiated with the rate x only once so here we can see y is only differentiated once second dif uh, second order dif uh, differential equations are basically the highest rate will be twice so here y you can as you can see y is differentiated twice so we call it a second order differential equation the grandes equation is basically a special case of second order differential equations in which the equation is exactly 1 minus x squared y differentiated twice minus 2x divided by dx plus lambda y is equal to zero, where modulus x is less than one. Here lambda is k into k plus one, where k is a non-negative integer. This is just a special case of second-order differential equations, as we see in see it in many areas of applied mathematics, physics, and chemistry. So these are the functions we use in this MATLAB software. So these are the main functions. So the first one, sims. Sims is basically a function that creates a variable dynamically. Say we put sims of p, a symbolic variable of p is then automatically assigned to the MATLAB variable with the same variable name. Then we have y solve. Y solve basically solves a problem specified for by f of x is equal to zero for x, where f of x is a function that returns a vector value. We can also use um, f solve, which also does the same thing. But here we are using y solve. Simplify is basically self-explanatory simplification of algebraic terms. This uh, refers to the regrouping of some polynomial terms under single terms. The cond value is basically the condition value. Applying the condition to different equations. F plot plots a graph for the differential equation. Grid adding the grid to the graph. The legend what it does is basically provides extra information about the graph. The necessary information. So these are the code procedures. The first question we have is one minus x into y differentiated twice minus two x y differentiated once plus twelve y is equal to zero. <clears throat> you have to solve the Lagrange equation where n is equal to zero. Here we have a different value n is equal to zero. So we start using the sims y this thing to solve the equation. So basically again what we do is just a variable, and ordinal one nine one is a variable that we Assign to the question. So this here is the entire question that we have, and again y solve. This is basically what y solve is. Basically, it solves a differential equation, and here we have b solve. B solve basically it solves a differential equation where the equation is a symbolic equation. So we get the output. Again, since we have n is equal to three, we have a definite unique output. So as you can see here, we have c one into three, three into x by two, and this is the full equation. Then we have the second equation, y differentiated once y cot x is equal to two x cosec x. So here again we use sims x as a to create the variable y x, and we have ordinal one nine one again as a uh, variable, and this is the same question we have on top. Again we use we use y solve here, and d solve for the question. Again as I said before, d solve solves the differential equation where the equation is a, uh, a symbolic equation. So here, since we don't have a definite unique value, we have we get a constant c1. C1 can be anything, any constant value. So this is the final answer we get here. 
In the next question we have g g dash is equal to 2g minus 3h and h dash equal to 4h minus 2g and here they have given us g of 0 is equal to 5 and h of 0 is equal to 5 again we have two definite given values here so we'll have to use the condition variable this time so again we use sims for the two variables odel then we put the two questions and then we use s is equal to d solve to solve the variable so again d solve as above and here we, we use cond1 and cond2 basically because we have the condition g of 0 is equal to 5 and g of uh, h of 0 is equal to 2 so basically that we put in the condition over there then we have f plot f plot basically plots a graph f plot g s o 191 so we have we basically plots a graph and hold on what then we are using hold on over here what hold on does is uh, basically a graphing function which retains a current plot uh, with a certain axis which uh, adds a graph to the existing graph then we have f plot okay that's to um, plot the graph then we have grid on to put the grid on and we have the legend the legend function to give more information about the graph here again we have since we have the unique values of g0 and g5 we have a unique answer we have a unique this thing without any constants and this is the graph we get from the same f plot and this is the conclusion this project was a great opportunity to connect theoretically knowledge, theoretical knowledge to practical implementation in the lf scenarios and this is the bibliography where i put all the links from where i've got help and used help thank you sir